An elk cow stands up from the snow and lowers her face to her calf, licks its face until it wobbles up, finds its feet. And that's the last anyone ever sees of those two, walking off into the grass, mother and calf, the herd out there waiting to fold them back in, walk with them through the seasons. Because it's the end of the story, the old man holds his right hand up again, like the girl did that day, and all the children do as well. And then, just like the girl does four years later, when her team loses state in double overtime, he balls that hand into an upraised fist. What the girl will be doing with that held-up fist at the end of that forever game, it's honoring the Crow team that finally figured out how to shut her down. The first defense to ever do that, and one of the last. That show of sportsmanship, of respect, of honor, it's what gets silhouetted on thousands of posters all through high school sports, all across the land that used to be hers. It's not the end of the trail, the headlines will all say. It never was the end of the trail. It's the beginning.